two. We're gonna do Sharon Van Etten's song, Serpents. It's one of her earlier songs, and it's uh, more of a guitar-based kind of music. Um, and she plays it with a capo at the second fret. We're not going to do use the capo. Uh, we're going to just uh, pretend our, our the nut of our guitar is the capo. Right? And then if you want to use a capo, you can put it anywhere. It doesn't change the way we're gonna, you play the song. This is how the song starts. This, uh, it's like a C without your index finger. You're only playing uh, strings, you know, five and four. If you hit uh, string three, that's all right. And it goes to like uh, having both uh, fingers on the on your D and your A string at the second fret. So C and this is uh one you know. Alright, I don't think I need to say any more about that. That is the verse. Most of the verse. Was a close call. They had no idea. Black eye. So after this this part, at the end of the verse, it goes to open uh, five and four. All right, and that that'll get you through uh, the verses. I think there's two verses at the beginning. That's the chorus. Um, you're gonna go to uh, the fourth and fifth frets, and you're gonna on your D string. You're gonna put your uh, middle finger, and on your A string, you're going to put your ring finger. You're going to play strings five through one, if you want to. If you <laughs> you can just play like you know five, four, three, two, or whatever. If you want to do it. If I was uh, playing acoustic, I would definitely do all the strings. If I was playing this, um, you know, with a little distortion and uh, very light, light distortion, some reverb and, and delay. Let me see if I get the. Then I would just play like the low of strings. But I, I, with the clean sound, like with the clean sound like this, um, you can hit all six. All right, what's going on here? All right, well, this is a, this is like a fancy D chord, okay? And you play all. It's like a D minor suspended seven nine chord or some something like that. I'm I'm not sure, but uh, it's a D chord. So uh, this is the big part of in my mind. In the harmonies, they're singing some of these notes. They're singing like this one. Uh, that's why it sounds so haunting. Then you go down to uh, this. Our C shape, you can play all those open chords there with the E, the, our, our fret two shape, you can play all the strings there. And then with the, when you go to open, I would just stop at like uh, string three, maybe two, if you get two in there it sounds alright. 
right? And that's the that's really what this whole song is. It's kind of a build up to this uh, chorus. Serpents in my mind, serpents in my mind. And I think when you're coming out of the verse, I think you're on this shape. Serpents in my mind. Uh, All right. And, uh, if, you know, you can use a capo on this. I think that's mostly why she uh, uses a capo is to get it into a comfortable vocal range for herself. Um, it doesn't give you a, any advantage playing the song. Uh, so... Uh, that's my lesson on Sharon Van Etten's Serpents. I hope she goes back to more uh, guitar-based music like this. I like her current music, but it is, is a bit heavy on the synthesizers. So, thanks for watching. Bye!